I must be crazy. I think I'm the most technical advanced person in the United States that uh, knows everything about these Gentex mirrors. Because I have a bunch of my collection apart. And what I'm doing, I am testing little diodes. A diode? What the hell's a diode? A diode is a one-way electrical valve, pretty much. Right. There, there's a diode. Diode. Where else was there a diode? Diode was right between here. Another diode. Uh, I have a mini one right here. We had another one over here, up top. And there was another one somewhere. Uh, another little red one. Yes, little red one hiding right over here. But anyway, I was testing all these. These are the, these are the uh, 221 boards to get the little extra little wires for the map lights. This is a uh, 177. Those don't have the wires, but um, these are the same little red ones. These red ones, they flow in e each direction, which is kind of strange, but the black ones don't. So I was thinking, hmm, you know, that one's the same, that one's the same. I had an old scrap radio board that, you know, I just have basically boards hanging around here now and then, so I just scrap them. So I tested a couple on there. Yeah, a couple of them look similar, same deal. They're traveling on both ways too. One way is a little more resistance, the other way is a little bit less resistance. And uh, so I thought that was kind of strange. i never seen that before. But that was the deal. Uh, that cap almost looks like it's a little bit bulged, but not a problem. Anyway, um, anyway, 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 these diodes all checked out. This mirror has never really been screwed with, so I kind of verified that maybe that's normal condition with the red ones. So, maybe it's not my problem. Damn, not my problem. So, now we get another big mess. We gotta clean it up. And, uh... I can't even show you, but nah, not gonna work. You just basically the um, and the stripe side is your grant. Yeah, negative. So you put your negative lead over there and your positive lead on the other side. And I believe so. Hold on. Yeah, my two-second memory was uh, working correctly. Negative is the stripe side. Stripe side negative, positive side, this is the black side, so you put your meter leads like that if you want to check it. You're going to get uh, flow, put it around the other way, you're not going to get flow. That's how you check it. Check your diode. So, I don't know what to do now. Uh, we'll probably just clean up some of this mess, put some RC cars away and whatnot, and polish what the hell is that doing there. I don't know. But, uh, you verified that's working correctly, so, I don't know, what to, what to do next? Set them all, set them all, no one will ever know what they've been tampered with, ha ha, no. That's why we're storing my, uh, my resto deal, because the little screw holes always get loose. I never showed you that either. When these mirrors, you're in a car and they start rocking back and forth, that little bolt right there loosens up so you just take them apart you crank down that I really should use Loctite but I haven't been and uh, it'll fix it up I ha originally had to do that when I put that first mirror in my truck it was rocking I go I can't drive around like this so I fixed it and it's pretty easy you just gotta use a uh, screwdriver and work around the edges very very very, very easily so you don't crack it like I did with this one. The first one I had, the 221, I crack it over there. Where else I crack it? I crack it somewhere over here, I crack it. So I have to do some nasty repairs in the bottom. Ooh, yeah. Nasty repairs. And I also chewed up the bottom a little bit. Right there. I sanded it all down, that looks a hell of a lot better. I used some 400 grit and then 2000. You know, that's skipping a lot of grades, but it worked. So, uh,. I tell you, uh, uh, sleep. This video is boring. That's how you check your boards and tighten up your mirrors. So it's cool.
learn how to do it. <clears throat> I'll add one more thing. See the boards? Well, this camera sucks, but if you look very close on the boards, any uh, diode's gonna be have a D in front of it. D1, D2, blah, 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 blah. All right, that's pretty neat. And a resistor. Resistor is gonna start with an R. Capacitor is gonna start with a C. Um, what else? I'm not sure. It says C28 too with the little chips. I don't know if that's any any uh, significance. Uh, Q. I don't know what Q is. Q is those those two black things over there. That's another Q and another Q. But that's all I can pretty much decipher from the board. So I thought that was kind of interesting. They are marked.